Oh, they're doing a button check? Oh, okay, guys. Yeah, they're just going to do a quick button check. Just old way. school. Yep. And then after the words, they're going to give each other a thumbs up. And then we're going to start. <laughs> we're back in 2016. Who's going to win the button check? <laughs> Who's going to win? Yeah. Who's going to check their buttons the best? Oh. So it looks kind of real. No, definitely a button check. All right. All right, it's definitely a button check. So Kachin King so so serious during a button check. <laughs> oh, look at him! Look at his face. He's big, he's really serious about this button check. Oh, well, this is the, okay. Never mind. This is the actual game. All right. So give us a second to choose uh, switch the overlays. So we got Kachin in the lead right now. Flurry of buttons. Activate. Nice. Throw in the corner. Oh, that was a great neutral jump. Really close. Oh, no. The EX boom is going to take it. So Kaching has gone with uh, V-Skill 2. Yeah. V-Skill 2, I think, is a good good pick against Balrog. No fireballs, obviously. Nice anti-air. Oh! You press standing heavy kick to interrupt. Yeah. Nice. Gonna catch him. Looks like he was on the other side. Uh, oh, sm small little shimmy. Yeah, but no punish. All right. Ronin's uh, stun still high. Yeah, but he's still going in. All right, there's the activate. Relentless. Yeah, you can't do those heavy dash punches. Oh no! Big block. Oh, oh no, there's a drop over there. Oh no. Oh, in the reset. reset. <laughs> All right. Overhead. Hey, and there the overhead are. into the throw. So, some combo drops on Ronin's side. I don't think he was uh, expecting those to work. Yeah, you gotta be prepared. Yeah. Yeah, we got a first to three, though. He did pretty good. They were all pretty close rounds. I think he can take this back. Oh, uh, nice 30. corner switch. Kachang's going to keep him in the corner like this as long as right. he can. Close to stun now. If there's anything Kachang is good at, it's making people panic in the corner. One thing I, I noticed that um, Ronin is not doing is uh, using his V reversal. I mean, like in this matchup, I think it's pretty good. Yeah, I think it's because he wants to make sure he's getting his trigger. But yeah, yeah you're right. It hasn't been paying off that much. Just push uh, Nash into the corner and then do your Balrog things. Yeah, do the Balrog thing. <laughs> nice. And that's a good anti-air. It's going to put him in the corner now. Nice, whip punish. Kaching is picking up with buttons, he's not expecting any melee from a uh, run. Ooh. Nice. Oh. Yeah, but Kaching, I've noticed as well, is a bit um, shy to punish the dash punches on block. It's like he doesn't believe that he's actually doing the really heavy ones. Yeah. You're gonna see EX boom. Into trigger. Uh, safe activate there. Hey, and there's a little gap, so he got hit by it. Spending the whole trigger is like that. Yeah, it's gone. All right, now you're gonna see catching special. Yeah, he's got four meter now. All right, uh, and yeah, that's it. So Kachang King taking another game there. Nash wins. I think Rome just needs to make sure that he's confirming his combo is right. And he just needs to stop it's doing so many... Um, waste of damage. Yeah, yeah. He needs to stop using his whole trigger all at once.
So some players are going to crack and they're going to press buttons um, after blocking for a certain amount of time. But when you play against someone as good as Cheng, you just got that patience. No anti air again. There we go. There we reverse as well. <laughs> nice. Oh, yeah. Puts him in the corner. In the corner again. How many times have we seen that? The anti air into throw into the corner. It's not hit confirming though. I mean, off the heavy kick. Nice right, blocking out of the corner. Yeah, use the EX to put him back in. I feel that, um, that, yeah, Ronin has him in the corner, but he's just walking back out. Like, he's, yeah. he's just afraid. Okay, one more mix up. Oh, oh. no! He we had him. He just needed to do one more uh, follow up, but he went into V skill. Yeah, that, that, that's a cutting special. When he wakes up and he does that, right? And if you block it, it'll be a CA after that. So yeah. <laughs> it's option select. Oh no, caught him pressing something. And he's gonna get the setup from this. Oh, and the stun took him out of the corner, but it's gonna be a lot of damage. Oh, it just built it. Well played. Yeah, well played from Kacheng. So that was not free by any means. We had some pretty close rounds from Ronin, got him in a few good situations. But he just needed uh, he just needed to confirm his combos a bit more and actually finish off his play. But that was winners, so Ronin isn't out of it yet. He's gonna be going down into the losers bracket. And he'll be playing against uh, looks like Okay, yeah. So Ronin is going to be playing against Dare Ace, but we're going to give uh, them a little break and we're going to go Freezer versus Sleepy Bones first. So we saw Freezer earlier playing, playing Honda versus TV's Yurian. Uh, now we've got Sleepy Bones. Uh, he used to play Zeku. Well, he still plays Zeku, but now he's been mostly playing Abigail and Seth. Yep. He's been in our scene for like two years now. Took a bit of a break during this 2020 season, but he's back in the mix now with a new character. Who's he using? Mena? He's playing Abigail yeah, now. Okay. Yeah, okay. Abigail. So his Abigail's pretty solid. He um, plays his neutral pretty slow. So it's going to be a battle of the Giants, Honda versus Abigail. <clears throat> home stage, home, home stage, home yeah. ground advantage. Honda bats. I don't believe I've seen this matchup. Yeah, it's it's not very often, hey, you get to see this. One in one? Yeah, I actually don't remember what... Uh, when I played Sleepy earlier, he used BT2, but it looks like he's gonna go one in one. <laughs> 